What's going on YouTube? These are the cards that I cracked throughout the week on my Instagram. Now we're going to check it out on YouTube and have a closer look. So the first two, um, I cracked a bunch of mainlines um, this week actually, a bunch. But we're only going to check out two because I think these two are really cool. Um, I honestly think that Hot Wheels uh, made them matching on purpose. This is a Toyota Land Cruiser 80 and this is an older Toyota Land Cruiser truck. So pretty sweet. This one's a treasure hunt. You can see right there the flame. But yeah, very nice. Very nice uh, details in the front. Headlights. You got your retro graphics along the side, which I love. This one has the Toyota stamped on the back. This one has a spare tire. No details on the back of either one besides the stamping and the spare tire. But, uh, this is the top. Very nice. They're this very nice color too as well. I like it. Um, both of them could use a wheel swap, but the main mainline rims that they got on there are, are nice. All right, definitely worth picking up, guys. If you guys are Toyota guys, truck guys, JDM guys, I just like collecting real cars like me. All right, let's uh, let's keep it with Hot Wheels and check out this Porsche. This is from the Canyon Warriors. Canyon Warriors set, so. Which is pretty nice I like this a lot of people seem to like this particular Porsche this Porsche has been released in the the main line already but this is the first time it's got released in the uh, gets released in the premium so that's cool all right next Hot Wheels this is the Integra from the Fast and Fierce I got an Integra myself, so I definitely really wanted this one. And in the movie, it was a four-door Integra. That's why they chose to do this one. They do have a two-door Integra casting, so it wouldn't have been hard for them to do that. So it's nice that they made a four-door version too as well. And then we got this premium right here. This is... Uh, the Sierra Cross Cosworth. We never had this car in North America. At least I never seen one. But uh, very nice. Very nice rally ish car. Alright, so from Hot Wheels, we're going to go to M2. We got this nice OBS truck, old body style truck. And then this one has the tunnel cover, which was killed. You can see by the elastic band that was holding it in place. So we'll just leave that there. Uh, this is very nice though. It has the big boy tires in the back and the skinnies in the front. So this one is ready to do some bad things if you want to. Um, nice motor detail by M2, like always. Let's actually zoom in on that, guys. Let's zoom in on that. You know what? Let me adjust the lighting a little bit, maybe. Here we go. Very nice. Always nice detail uh, from M2 in regards to the motor. Um, the hood doesn't close too well. And like I said, this little tunnel cover was messed up. But I mean, other than that, the casting is nice. They did a good job with the OBS trucks. And then we are going to move to a green light. And this is an old school green light, because you can tell by the green ribbon in the front. This is a, four, uh, sorry, a Shelby GT500. You can see that right there. And this one is very well done. It's very nice. The color is nice. Detailing is nice. Actually, this one's worth a little zoom in too, so you guys can see the the little details. Yeah, the rims are nice. Everything's very well done. Interior looks pretty good too as well. You got your license plate there. A little logo on the top there, very good. This one does have an opening hood as well. See the motor, the blue. Very good. And this one closes nice. Um, oops. Oh, 
There you go. This one closes nice. The hood. So I appreciate that. All right, let's clean this table up a little bit. All right, next up is going to be this NO. And they're giving us this beautiful R34 in the very classic midnight purple color. And this thing is gorgeous, guys. I'll give you guys a wide view. Then we'll zoom in a little bit on this. Yeah, I do a quick reel, like I was saying earlier, of all these cars. Just an op unboxing, opening, cracking open, whatever you want to call it. They do have a brake set up in there, so that's nice. I like that kind of detail. And you can see the interior. Looks very good too as well. Yeah, so I do a quick reel, and then I'll come here on YouTube, and we'll have a nice look at these models. Some of them, some of them really deserve a nice little zoom in like this, and some a little bit of time, you know, instead of just a quick attention grabbing reel. All right, uh, last but not least, this beautiful piece by Micro Turbo. And this beautiful purple. We'll zoom in on this guy too. I just wanna give you guys a quick wide view of it, full view. You can see the rear diffuser, pretty cool. All right, we'll zoom in right here. All right, let's have a look. Miata, rear diffuser, exhaust pipes. You got your little, little antenna there. There is some kind of brake setup in there. I can't really make it out though. The interior in this one's amazing. You can see the gauges. You can see the HVAC controls and uh, the shifter. Obviously, the seats, cup holder. Very good. And the uh, reflective material in the side mirrors is actually reflective. Oh, so is the, the rear view mirror. It's actually reflective as well. That's cool. And then uh, last but not least, my favorite feature is these pop-up headlights. And they do it very well. It's very smooth. You guys can see how smooth it is. Let me get to, to that switch. The switch is very small. Uh, but once you get to the switch, you see how smooth it is. And the headlights are amazing. Amazing. Very nice looking. See the lines in the headlights? That's that's what does it. Very good. And you can see the intercooler. There you go. You can see the intercooler. Very nice piece. And uh, these, uh, these are all right. These rims here. This one spins very nicely in the front. In the back it does not but uh, I bet you it rolls perfect yeah it rolls beautifully all right guys that's uh that's a couple of the pieces I cracked that I wanted to give you guys a closer look at if you guys haven't subscribed already please subscribe give me a follow on Instagram make a comment like whatever you want to do. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.